How's it going? And welcome to Test That Tech. Today we will be drop testing the Sony Extra Bass Wireless Bluetooth Speaker. So here's the charging port. It is a micro USB to a USB. This is a strap to hold it. So the entire body of this is made of plastic, except for these buttons are made from rubber. It is water resistant of IPX5, which means that it can withstand water getting sprayed on it, but it is not meant to survive if it is immersed in water. It has this flap here that covers up the micro USB port and an audio in jack along with the reset button. Let's see if it turns on. So it turns on and works. So now we are going to be doing a series of drop tests on this. So let's test that tech. So how I'm going to be doing this drop test is I will be simulating a realistic drop off of these ledges, so I'm going to put the speaker on the ledge and then push it off with my finger so it falls onto the concrete. First I'm going to do off of this ledge, which is about a foot and three quarters off the ground. This second ledge was about three feet off the ground. And since I don't have a ledge that's six foot high, I'm just going to hold it about six feet off the ground and then drop it straight onto the concrete. I will be doing this twice for each height and after each drop I will show the device to see if any damage was done. So the first drop is going to be a foot and three quarters onto the back side of the speaker. So it doesn't look like there was any damage to the speaker. So the next one will be a foot and three quarters to the front. So it doesn't look like there was any damage to it except for a few scuffs from a foot and three quarters. So the next drop will be a three foot drop onto the back of the speaker. So it has a scuff on there. Nothing on the back. And it still turns on. So the next drop will be a three foot drop onto the front of the speaker. It's not too much damage. Um, the speaker part has protruded out a little bit. But you can just push it back in. And it still turns on. You can see from the blue flashing light. This next drop will be a six foot drop onto the back of the speaker. So you could hear some rattling and the front part of the speaker almost fell off. It's protruding out pretty bad. Don't see any other damage. Let's see. I could just get pushed back in. So this next drop will be a six foot drop onto the front of the speaker. All right. So the screen stayed intact this time. Um, don't know if you hear that. There is something shaking inside. Popped off. Let's see if it turns on. And it still turns on. So the Sony speaker survived a lot better than I thought it would. I thought the plastic body would break if nothing else crack. But surprisingly it didn't. Really the only major damage was a few scuffs around the top. The screen did pop out, but it's not coming out now. And yeah, there's a few scuffs on the back, but that's about it. And as we showed before, it still turns on. So the Sony Extra Bass speaker is actually pretty durable. 
Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. I would appreciate it if you would like this video and subscribe to my channel. If you have a Sony Bluetooth speaker, leave a comment down below of what you think of it.